my name is Billy. I'm going to teach you how to make the first flower in a daisy chain. So this is a beading technique uh, with seed beads. You could do this with any size of seed bead, but I am using the larger seed beads. Let's see, can you see this okay? Like that. And so, <clears throat> In this uh, flower, there's going to be at least seven or eight steps. And the first step is putting this first large seed bead onto the needle, bringing it all the way to the end of the string. And then once you get that, you're going to bring your needle up through the bottom of the seed bead. And this will essentially lock it into place. Like so. So that is the first step done. Your second step is going to grab three more of the same color seed beads, plus one color that is slightly different or whatever color you choose um, to represent the middle of the flower. Like so. So there's the three petals and then the middle of the flower. And you're going to bring those down to the bottom where the first seed bead is. Like that. So that, now within this second step, you're going to bring your needle up through the three seed beads that are in the middle. And you'll pull that through. And it'll look like this. So after you got that done, you're going to pick up four more of the seed beads. This will be step three. Four more of the seed beads that are the petal color. And you're going to put them onto your string. Three and four. All right, there I go. I got the four on there. See, like so, and you're going to bring them down where everything else is, like so, and you're going to go up and through this is the fourth step. You're going to go up and through the middle seed bead that's a different color that's representing the middle of the flower. And make sure when you come back up through, one second, sorry. Make sure that you Skip that first bead in the four, like that. And then you, the fifth step, you go through the last three beads plus that very first bead in the, um, that you put on in step one. So I was wrong about the steps. I think there's only going to be like five steps. So now you have your completed daisy flower. And one, if you wanna make it into a daisy chain, you just bring it back up through the three beads that were after the first flower.
And there you have a starting point for a new daisy to be put on. All right, I hope you learned something new today. And I'm sorry if I was a little confusing about the steps. But yeah.